Hand washing with soap at the gate is a must, and for, it is for all persons entering the hospital. Whether you're official, non-official, staff or not, everybody must wash. Because the hand is the one biggest transmitter of that problem. We would like to ask, if you are not sick, please do not come to the hospital. Please stay at home. Don't even go to town, stay at home. We have seen people walking in town, hugging one another, and doing all sorts of things. These are right ways of spreading the disease. No contact. To minimize contacts, don't come to the hospital, stay at home. Avoid visiting the sick. You're going to infect them. They're already sick, then you bring corona. What will happen? Corona kills almost all those who are already sick. If it is the second disease you're going to have, you go. We are not sparing our members of staff. Staff cars must, be, must bear stickers to access the hospital entry. Without that, they stay out. We have taken all these steps in guidance with the Minister of Health so that we protect our already ailing brothers and sisters in the hospital. If we don't protect them, the ones coming from out, we don't know who has this disease, they will be infected and they will bear a second disease and this will be a bad thing for them because the disease kills those who are already ill much more than those who are healthy. If a patient is referred to us from a place care with the ordinary diseases, we treat them as we used to. Okay? We treat them as we used to. And that will enable us to receive the referrals in. If it is a referral of Corona, we have a holding area, an admission place, where we admit our cases of, 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 of highly infectious diseases like Ebola. That will continue to be an only. So the admission for the other patients will remain the same way. But we are setting up a tent next to the Ascari's house where everybody coming to the hospital will be screened. Because as you know, 80% of the people who, 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 who acquire Corona are actually not going to be sick. They are symptomless. They don't have any signs or symptoms. They don't complain. All you might pick is a temperature or something little. But we have come up with training materials and the Minister of Health has sent some people. As we speak now, we are having training on our health workers going on. Is it the capacity or willingness? I would rather discuss the willingness. Being a brand new disease, who has the capacity? No one. Otherwise, our capacity is getting built every day. Every day as we get back. You said your kits and thermometers. The, 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 the way the banks or whoever else acquired their protective gears. Or all their, the things they use is, is actually beyond us. Uh, and it's very difficult for us to control. I have walked, you have seen people in gloves. We put on the gloves in the morning until evening. The thing which was white by evening it is cream colored. Yes? Touch this, then touch the phone, then touch the computer, then swing around, touch I don't know what else. Then the, the, news, the, the, the newspaper you brought, they also touch it. Then everything is touched by the same glove. So assuming there was a jam in the morning and this fell at time, by evening how many would have this there? And because they are gloves, they are not washing hands. And washing hands is one thing we have said over and over and say, wash your hands. You put on gloves, that will be. So uh, for the institutions that are not government, we expect them to call. Can we have a system? We had the IGG came for opinion here and we were able to tell them what to do. So if the other ones are doing it, they're not told us, we don't know what they're doing.